What's going on YouTube? It's your buddy Will from the What's Up in the Sky 37 channel or online at www.whatsupinthesky.com. I just wanted to say, I don't really have anything political to say about this. I used to have a whole political channel, Will Farrar Music. I, I was big for Ron Paul. I just, I'm just i all about peace and about America not being used uh, in the way that we do get used as our military gets used. I've got We come from a military family. Um, you know, and, and the whole government shutdown thing, I don't even watch TV as much anymore. I just look at the alternative media. My mom is stuck watching, you know, the various shows. She, she watches them all, you know, Fox, CNN. So she gets the propaganda from every single side, the left to right, which is all propaganda because they all work for the same people. And that's about as, as political as I'm going to get in this. But I've been on the message boards and stuff this morning. I woke up. I, I got a couple emails from my buddy Arcane. Um, it looks like uh, a couple people. I think Dabu7, he's cool. I like that. I love his videos. Uh, he put out a video about this. And it's really crazy how, and I was one to say, Come on, the government shut down. I, it is what it is. But NASA, from what I've seen and what I've been able to look at, they've uh, about 97% of their operations are going to be shut down during this. Which mean, you know, and it, which means really the only people there are going to be the security guards. You know, the people with the guns. You know, and stuff like that. So I was reading on a couple message boards, and there was somebody who worked for NASA. And I haven't called my now. I got a couple of buddies who work for NASA, um, which I'm sure he's probably furloughed right now. The one that that lives close that works down at Wallops. Um, I'm gonna give him a call today and see what's going on with him if he's furloughed or not, which I'm sure he is because he works on satellites and stuff like that and uh, trajectories and stuff when they're launching the satellites um, and the computer systems interacting with computer systems. It's amazing what what NASA does, but. 97% of the employees, that means we're not going to have cl no climate science going on. Um, ISON, we're, we got like the biggest, I mean this is going to be, the if the government isn't ramped back up, isn't turned back on, we're going to have to have, this is going to be the private sector is going to have to shine, I mean, and, and the general public, I mean, ISON is going to be rocking around Mars today. Um, then it's going to be hitting around the sun, and if it comes back out, it's going to be beautiful. So it's going to be, you know, amateur astronomers going to have to step up and take over the slack. Um, and I don't know how that would work. Um, I'm sure the rovers, I don't know if the people who work for the rover are still going to be in place or not. Um, I know right now it's on AutoNav on its way. From what I was read a couple of times, it's been on AutoNav. I mean, it's pretty much rocking and rolling, so they could let the thing run up there. But essential, non-essential, and only government could make up words like that. Essential, non-essential, and essential employees. I mean... Come on, that's a, that's something that uh, this twisted, you know, words that they use. That's I mean, come on, this is crazy. When ISA, this is one of the biggest events. I mean, we just ISA was just discovered in 2012. Um, and there's reports out of other areas. Now, I'm not one for ISA doom and gloom. I've I've actually gone and commented on other people's channels and said stop. Stop presenting fear. And if you really believe that ISON is going to take out the world, then why don't you defund your channel and stop making me look at advertisements? I have advertisements on my channels, but I'm not saying that we're all going to die October 1st to you know the end of the the end of the year. And not many people are saying that, but they're alluding that we're going to lose our power. You know, we're going to get hit by asteroids. Stuff that stuff's going to happen. And with these fireballs, I've been wrong before. I was wrong. I, I at one time believed maybe 2012 would be the end. You know, and uh, I prepared for it, just like I think you should always be prepared. I'm prepared. I'm in Maryland on the shore. Um, believe me, if there is a uh, <laughs> if there is a uh, tsunami, it might come in as far as I am. You know, I'm only 10 miles inland, so I mean, I might be thrashed here anyway. But I'm ready. I've got a lot of water. One thing you supply on, I've probably got water for the whole neighborhood, the whole street. I'm not a neighborhood, but I'm like a street um, for like a month. I mean, I've got tons of water saved. Um, food, stuff like that, canned goods, dried food, rice, stuff like that. I've got all that saved up. Batteries, um, flashlights, you name it. I've got all that just for hurricanes and stuff like that to come by. You should always be prepared. But the unnecessary fear that came along with ISON it was uh, just very, very unheard. It's it's everywhere. I mean, if you type in ISON on on YouTube, you're gonna get scared. <laughs> it's it's probably gonna scare the hell out of you. Uh, when it's going to be a beautiful event, I really don't think that's going to. We're not going to lose our. If, if anything, the the we need to worry about what's on this planet, not what's above. There might be a threat out there, but honestly, there's nothing we can do about it. If there's something out there coming at us, what are we going to do? I mean, we're primitive in our technology. We may have some neat stuff, and uh, but there's not much we could do to 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 do anything about it. I mean, other than kiss our ass goodbye. 
and, and panic. And that's why the government won't tell us if there is something coming. But it is very interesting that they are shutting down the government. And I'd be interested to see if the senators stick around D.C. Because a lot of people are saying that they're leaving D.C. But um, I just got a call from Campaign Liberty. They're down there working. You know, people are people are still there. So I'm interested to see if the senators stick around or whatnot. Um, either way, they let's get NASA back up and running. Hopefully they get this stuff squared out. But I just thought it was very interesting as ISON approaches Mars and uh, everything cool happens. You know, what what coincidence that we've got to go with a... Uh, NASA's going to get shut down as well. Um, I would think that NASA would be one of our essential operations just because of the uh, work they do with asteroids and protection and just the, the climate weather research that we do alone is... is uh, crucial so much love guys take it easy i've uh, been blabbing about this too long um in just case you didn't know nasa 97 percent furloughed and uh, that that was like i said 97 i shouldn't even say 97 percent because i heard that on comment boards from somebody who says they're at nasa which we know that people come on youtube and say there's something all the time <laughs> much love